Hello guys, in this video I'm going to show you how you can download and install Java JDK on your Windows 10 operating system. So let's get started. First of all, open your favorite browser and search for Java JDK. And uh, here you will see the first link which will appear here will be from oracle.com. Just click this link here. And here you will see two options. One is Java platform with JDK and other is NetBeans with JDK 8. We want to click this uh, Java button here and in here you will see various options to download Java on your Windows operating system or Linux or Mac OS. So first of all just click this accept license agreement this radio button and then you can uh, download these executable file for your operating system so we want to install it for our windows operating system and if you are using windows 10 most probably you have a windows 64 bit so just click this last option okay and it's going to install java jdk on your uh, windows 10 operating system now once it's uh, downloaded i have already downloaded it it's going to look like this it's uh, it will be like a executable file which you can run so just just double click on it and it's going to show you uh, this uh, user account control just click yes and i'm going to minimize everything else and now the java setup has been started you just need to click next here and leave everything as default click next now while this installation is going on let's see how to check whether java is already installed on your system or not so the simple way to check if java is installed in your system is just go to your uh, Windows start button here and right click here and open command prompt and by the way our Java installation is asking for uh, this uh, next procedure so just click next and then we will come to uh, this command prompt and in here you just need to uh, write Java C and press enter and if it gives you uh, this uh, result that Java C is not recognized as an internal or external command, then most probably Java is not installed on your system. So close this command prompt for now. We will check it once again once Java is installed on our system. And when the Java installation is complete, it will give you this uh, message that Java SE Development Kit 8 update. 60 successfully installed you just need to click close and now what you need to do is open your folder explorer and go to your uh, pc or click this pc and go to c folder and go to program files and here you will be able to see this folder called java and inside this Java, you will see uh, two folders. One is JDK, another is JRE. So for simplicity, you can just uh, rename those as only JDK and JRE. So JDK, JDK stands for Java Development Kit and JRE stands for Java Runtime Environment. Okay, so JDK and JRE. Now, once you have installed uh, Java, you just need to set up environment variable for Java so that whenever some program wants to uh, look for Java, it's automatically recognized uh, by your program. So to uh, set up environment variable, what you need to do is right click on your Windows button here, not left click, but right click, right? So left click will open this option but when you right click it will open this these options and in right click you will see uh, this option called control panel just open it and in here go to systems and in here click system 
okay so go to system and security and click system and in here you just need to click advanced system settings and in here you will be able to see uh, this environment variables and in here go to system variables here and just go down and click the option which says path okay so just double click on it and it's going to open it so we need to add it this path uh, variable system variable right so go at the last and what you need to do is you need to copy the location where you have installed this Java so go to program files Java and go inside JDK folder and then go inside bin folder where all the binary files are there and copy this location which is C program file slash Java slash JDK slash bin right and then give a semicolon here and then paste your path which you have copied which is uh, c colon slash program file slash java slash jdk slash bin okay and once again give a semicolon here and then go to the folder where you have installed uh, java once again and in here this time go to jre folder and inside jre go to bin folder okay and once again copy this path and after the semicolon just paste this path here okay and click ok which will uh, save your paths and click ok once again click ok once again and you can minimize this and now once again when you open the command prompt so just open command prompt once again and then run java c once again so java c and press enter and now you can see it will give you so many options and Java C is basically a command to compile Java source files so it will give you uh, this message that uh, the usage of Java C is like this Java C then options then source file right so now Java JDK is installed on your system now in some cases you may want to uh, configure Java home also after installing java so let's see how we can uh, configure java home so once again right click on your start menu and then go to control panel and once again go to system security and once again go to system and in here go to advanced system settings and go to environment variables and this time we will go to user variables for your whatever your computer name is and in here just click this uh, new button and we will create a new variable name which is java in capital and then underscore and then home and this will be the variable name which is java home so make it capital and separate it by underscore and then write it home so just remember that the spelling must be same and uh, separated by, by this uh, underscore right and in here you need to give the path to your JDK folder so go to the location wherever you have installed Java and go to the JDK folder and then copy the path of the JDK folder and paste it here okay and click OK OK and OK so in this way you can configure Java home uh, environment variable so I hope you have enjoyed this video please wait comment subscribe and bye for now